Oh man, Ron, we are on day three with Doug Bowden. And that was crazy. Like the amount of knowledge that we're able to get from this free course has been phenomenal. Yeah, a free challenge. And, and I can't wait for everyone to talk about and listen to when Doug is speaking to the obstacle is the way. Yeah, I, I think so many people don't understand. You know, they'll hit that obstacle and they stop or they go the opposite way. But that's actually the way you should run towards. Yeah, yeah. You figure it out. You figure out how to get through it and then you help others get get through it quicker, right? Like that's kind of some stuff that we've been chatting since we started. Like we want to help people get through things that we got stuck on faster. So uh, what do you say? Let's get to it. Have you ever wondered how highly successful entrepreneurs think? So did we. So we asked hundreds of entrepreneurs a very simple question. If they had perfect hindsight, what advice would they give themselves? I am Corey Carter. And I'm Ron Cool. Join us on our journey implementing and sharing all of our learnings while we hack our hindsight along with our guest hindsight to give us all better foresight. Listen along the way as we find and unlock their secrets that made them successful through hidden traffic, joint ventures, and much, much more. This is Hindsight Hack. What is up, everybody? Welcome to day two of the Freedom Funnel five-day workshop. So we're going to start here in a moment. If you guys are watching live, let me know where you're watching from. I'm going to pull up the comments here so I can see all of your comments. And we're going to give it a few minutes for everybody to jump on. And we're going to jump right into an awesome presentation. So um, I'm going to ask you guys a couple of questions today. It's going to really help you gain a lot of clarity around what kind of course you're creating, um, who you're going to serve, and what problem you're going to help solve. So you have no clue right now, um, or maybe you have too many ideas. We're going to help you pick one. So I'm really excited for this. If you guys are jumping on, again, um, do me one favor. Um, I noticed a lot of you guys, we had like 800, almost actually, I think we had 1,000 comments yesterday. 1,000 comments, but no one really liked this. So to spread our message, get this out there. Everyone do me a favor, hit the like button, hit the um, a heart button, do one or the other, whatever you do. Um, I prefer the heart if you can. Spread the love. And uh, let me just pull this up here. Okay. All right, and then while you're doing that, let me know where you're watching from. Always good to know where you guys are watching from. All right, we're ready to go. What's up, David? Hello, hello, welcome. Congratulations on being a top contributor yesterday. All right, so if you guys didn't need, uh, see, I put out a post yesterday or earlier today of all the top contributors. So thank you guys so much for sharing this challenge. Thank you for contributing. I really appreciate it. I noticed everything you guys are doing here in this group, the collaborations, the connections you guys are making. So continue to do that stuff. All right, so again, if you guys are watching this live right now, let me know in the comments where you're watching from. Smash the like button, the heart button. Um, I want to get as many people on as possible. And we're going to get super clear today on exactly what we're building out. All right. So uh, I'm going to start here in a moment once we get everybody on. What's up, Matt? What's up, Brett? Congratulations, Brett, number one of the top contributors from yesterday. All right. I just noticed my bot, uh, bot just went out. So we'll give this about two more minutes and let that um, get everybody here. Cool. 78 people on. Let's get that number going. Coming in hot from Oregon. Michigan, what's up? Who was that? We have, uh, sorry if I'm looking down, I'm looking at my, my comments here. Aaron from Buffalo, welcome back. Corey Denver, we got Tori Bannock on. Hello, we got Frank Estrada. What's up, everybody? All right, cool. So I'm going to share my screen here in a second. Um, today, we're going to be answering uh, a lot of questions. I'm sure a lot of you guys saw yesterday's training. Do me a favor, actually, if you are watching this right now and you have not watched yesterday's training, what you're going to do is stop right now. Um, you're going to come back and watch the replay later. I don't want you to watch this because it's not going to make sense. So I'm going to share my screen and let me just show you where I want you to actually go. All right, so boo, boo, boo. here we go. So if you are watching this right now and you did not watch yesterday's training, I want you to go to units in this group. Go to units, 
go to one of five. We're on day two right now. So go day one of five, and I want you to watch day one first. It's not going to make sense today if you didn't do this first step. So go and watch this video. Come back and watch the replay for this later on, okay? It's not going anywhere. It's going to be here right in the units tab. Uh, by the way, everything you guys need is in the units tabs. Um, unit one is going to be all the five days of training. Obviously, tomorrow is Wednesday. Then we'll have Thursday and Friday. So those aren't live yet, but we're live here today. It just hit 100 people. Awesome. Let's keep it going. Um, I really appreciate you guys. Check this out, by the way. We crushed it. You guys are amazing. Out of 700 people who registered for this challenge, I just want to celebrate you right now. Um, we had, we had, let me move Marge out of the way. Um, 635 people did the homework yesterday. All right. I know it wasn't that hard of a task, um, but that's still amazing out of 700 people. Like that's like 90 something percent of you guys went out and did this homework. So congratulations to you. Um, I'm going to speak facts right now. You guys, that number is going to go down tomorrow. Prove me wrong. I want you to prove me wrong. All right. Um, prove me wrong. I don't want to be right there. Um, but I just know, um, let me just move this here. Here we go. Um, Today's homework's gonna be a little bit harder than just tell me your number one takeaway. We're actually gonna do stuff today. We're gonna build out the thing that I want you guys to create. So I know I'm gonna lose you guys because I'm gonna tell you why. We're gonna tell you why later on. But I want you guys to prove me wrong. I want you to all show up and do the homework again. Day two, I want you to remain eligible for the scholarship on Friday. To do that, you have to finish the homework every day. Um, today's task, we will be naming our course. Um, it sounds easy, but it's going to be a little hard for a lot of you guys. But I'm going to show you guys everything you need to know right now in this training today on how you're going to find out who you're going to serve, what problem you're going to solve, and um, the name of your course. All right. It's going to happen. So today we're really mapping out the, the framework of your course. And then tomorrow we're going to build it. So i um, really looking forward to this, guys. Let me do this. What I want to do right now is let me just double check, see if we got everybody here. And we're going to share my screen. We're going to go right into this. Awesome. Here we go. All right, guys, you guys ready? <laughs> this is exciting stuff. And just congrats again, congratulations to all of you guys who did the homework. Like, I know it's not that big of a deal, but to me it is because it just means that people who are signing up to this challenge, over 700 of you, are action takers. You're doing the work. And I want you to keep that pattern going. Um, so let me share my screen. We're going to get right into today's presentation. Okay, here we are. Inception. <laughs> Funny story about this owl right here, by the way. I'll tell it later if you guys remind me. All right, so day two, let me share this from beginning. We'll flip this around. And there we are, day two, mapping out your freedom funnel. So those of you guys who don't know what a freedom funnel is, you probably didn't pay attention yesterday. But a freedom funnel is what we're creating today. My whole thing right now is, you know, we're all taught to build out this hard, complicated funnel, uh, even when we don't know what we're supposed to be doing. So today we're gonna figure out what we're supposed to be doing, and I want you just to focus on a simple funnel. I call it my freedom funnel. And all it is is a, a free members area that attracts, nurtures, and converts your leads on autopilot. All right, very, very cool stuff. I know it's, for you, some of you guys, this is like brand new stuff. For some of you guys, it's a little bit uh, beginner, but I want you guys to rethink this because even though I've had my course now for over 18 months or not, but about 16 months, I want to say, because I quit my job 18 months ago, it took me a few months to build the free course. Um, but you guys can do it in five days because I've learned the hard way. I'm showing you guys everything I did to learn what I did. I want you guys to do it faster. All right. Imperfect action is what we're going to be doing today. So today we're going to map out exactly what's in our free course. And then tomorrow we're actually going to go out and build it. We're going to build out your members areas. It's not hard using click funnels when you have an instructor like me, who's been doing this for a long time. Um, so don't jump ahead. I don't want you guys to get confused and frustrated. So let's just map it out. Cool. All righty. All righty. Hello, Kathy. How are you? Kathy stone in the house. Hey Todd, how are you? What's going on guys? Hashtag action taker, right? You said it. All right, let's get going, guys. I respect your time. I want to keep to an hour, and uh, we got some very uh, informative things today for you in today's workshop. So here's the goal, guys. Today we're going to go um, over how to find out who you want to serve and what problem you will solve for them. Uh, we will even outline your free course and give it a name. All right, the first steps. So right now, uh, tell me below, you're either one or two people. <laughs> I know it's you fall into one category because um, I was the same way. Uh, you're either you either have too many ideas or you have no idea of what you want to create here today. 
All right, let me know in the comments. Number one, uh, if you have too many ideas. Number two, if you have no ideas. And number three, if you already have your idea, tell me your idea. I would love to know. A lot of you guys commented yesterday on a post I put out, and uh, a lot of you guys knew exactly what you want to create. I love that. Um, and if you don't know yet, you're about to find out. We're going to go over it today. Um, but I was option number one. I was the guy who had too many ideas. All right. When I first started, I was working full time in a restaurant. I was working full time as a sales rep. Um, I was um, taking on clients, building out funnels for them. I was building up my debt relief course. I was you know, being an affiliate for ClickFunnels and guess how many results I had, guys? None. I had zero results. Why? Because I'm doing too many freaking things. So <laughs> Jerry says way too many. Exactly. So we're going to pick one, guys. We're going to pick the most viable thing, even if it's not like your purpose. It's okay. It's okay if you don't know your purpose. Um, I've had meltdowns because I don't know my purpose and it's okay. It's normal. But we're going to talk about why it doesn't really matter right now. All right. It's going to help you guys. So keep commenting. Let me know if you have too many ideas or if you have no idea. And if you have your idea, let me know what it is. I'd love to know who you're going to help and what problem you're going to solve. And again, if you don't know, you're going to find out right now. So here's our agenda. You guys know me. I like to stick to a plan and make sure you guys know where we are at in that plan every single day of this workshop challenge. All right. Number one, we're going to check in. We're going to see everyone's doing okay. Questions that you have. Number two, we're going to go over who do you serve and what problem do you solve? And again, if you don't know, you're about to find out. We're going to go over the 10 levels of opportunity and where you stand. Oop, I keep feeling that. i got to fix that. Number four is obstacle is the way. If you guys took the One Funnel Away Challenge, you guys understand the obstacle is the way. But if not, we're going to go over that today because it changed everything for me. Number five is collaboration versus competition. Um, and that's so vital, guys. If we're all doing the same thing, if we're all teaching ClickFunnels to everybody in the world, we're all competing. But if we could find a niche that we could help whether it's really the ClickFunnels or not, it doesn't really matter. Again, we're gonna go over a few options today of what people are doing and what you can do. But um, I believe in collaboration and that is an abundant mindset of I want you guys to, to step into that. All right, and number six, uh, questions invite revelation. Uh, one question that was asked to me, I'm gonna tell you guys when we go through this section that changed everything. It made me choose ClickFunnels affiliate and why. Um, so is that one thing I wanted to focus on? And then number seven, we're going to go over today's homework assignment and, and assign that to you guys. All right. So let's get into it. Um, so where are you guys struggling so far? I want to know. Um, I mean, we didn't really do much yesterday. We kind of just did an overview. So if you didn't watch that video, please go to unit one of this. Stop watching right now. Go watch unit one, lesson one. It's day one challenge. I want you guys to watch that workshop video. All right. Um, and then also, if you guys didn't sign up to ClickFunnels, you're going to need ClickFunnels. Um, let's go. I want you guys to get in there, get familiar with the editor. Tomorrow, I'm giving you guys a template that we're going to go and edit. All right. And you're going to really need ClickFunnels for that. So I want to give you guys today to go out there and start navigating your 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 desk, um, your workspace, grab your affiliate links. OK, so go to DougBouton.com forward slash 14 day trial. Um, if uh, one of my assistants are watching, could you guys drop that in the uh, comments, please? All right. Um, if you guys are watching the replay, it'll be above in the description. So go to the links. All the links you need are here. All right. Um, do me a favor. If someone sent you to this training, please ask them for their affiliate link. I want them to get the credit for this. OK, uh, that's the right thing to do. So go ask the person that sent you to this training um, and ask them for their ClickFunnels affiliate link. And if you don't have anyone that did that, uh, sign up with me. That's awesome. I have a great bonus for you guys. Reach out when you do. Go start your 14-day free trial, dougbouton.com forward slash 14-day trial, or click the link that hopefully someone's going to post below for me in the comments. Um, and yeah, go and start navigating the dashboard. Uh, click on the affiliate tab in the right corner and go get your affiliate links. You're going to need them uh, starting tomorrow. All right, we're gonna. Uh, that's for those of you guys who want to promote ClickFunnels. Most most of you guys here, but if you're not, this still works for anything, anybody. Okay, very cool. All right, so okay, guys, some tough love right now. All right, I just gotta let me just stop sharing for a second. I hope you guys could uh, see my face. <laughs> um, where are you guys? Here we are. So okay, here we go. Real quick, guys, this is driving me nuts. Um, I need action takers. I need people to follow directions, okay? Um, I gave you guys pretty simple things, and I, I rewatched it, so I know it's not my fault. All right, I would take blame if it was my fault. I need you guys to follow directions, and you guys weren't yesterday. It drives me crazy, um, and that just tells me you're not watching the videos. So please watch these trainings every day before you start posting and doing crazy things. Um, let me just show you what I mean. 
<laughs> All right, you're probably like, what the heck's this guy talking about? Um, but uh, I'm a nice guy, but one I just want to make sure you guys know, like, I mean business. All right, we got we got to stay on the schedule here. Um, share screen. Let me just show you guys what I mean. All right, so in this group, okay, you guys are messing up. Some of you guys, not everybody. You guys are awesome. But look, units tabs. When you post the homework, guys, the only place I want you to paste. Post your homework is here in unit two, not on day one, not on day two, not or day three. I want you to go to unit two and I want you to find the lesson. So yesterday, homework is closed. All right. You can't, you can still post the homework, but you're not going to, if you missed the opportunity at midnight, you're out of the competition for the scholarship. It's okay. Still stick with us. You're going to do awesome things this week. But a lot of you guys are like posting homework everywhere and people are following suit. Um, don't post it on the unit two, like 24 of you guys posted here. I want you to post it right here on the image. So day one homework right here. Uh, by the end of this lesson, you guys are going to see day two homework pop up right underneath unit two. So you're going to go to unit two. You're going to see day two homework right here below day one. You're going to click on that actual link and you're going to post the homework there. All right. Just want to make sure I'm super clear. I don't know if I could be any more clear about that. All right. So follow instructions. I want to work with action takers, not people not watching the videos and doing things wrong. <laughs> All right. Enough yelling at you guys. I love you guys. Just, uh, just wanted to make sure that was clear. Okay. We're back at it. We're back in. Let's do this. So uh, do the homework, make sure you're posting the right spot. You have to post it in the right spot to get the credit for remaining eligible for the scholarship drawing on Friday. All right. Um, also, if you um, you can apply to be an affiliate at what's your dream um, or if you just sign up to click funnels, you're actually automatically an affiliate. You'll get your affiliate links there in your dashboard. All right. And then uh, let's talk about the scholarship a little bit. All right. So we have some updates. I post the leaderboard for a lot of you guys. Um, who were ranked uh, as top contributors. And those of you guys who are sharing this, I'll go over your names uh, at, at the end of this presentation. Cool. All right, guys. Very good. Very good. And I forgive you. No worries. Just make sure you guys are watching and then following instructions. Cool. Next, number one mistake. This is the number one mistake I see people doing when they come into the online world whether it's promoting affiliate, whether it's doing done for you services, uh, whether it's selling physical products or um, designing and selling funnels. You try to serve everybody. You try to build funnels for everybody. You try to take on clients that are all over the place. That's the wrong idea, uh, especially when affiliates, you're trying to uh, sign up anybody to click funnels. I see people going to click funnels groups and trying to sign up people that already have click funnels. Dumb idea. Dumb, dumb idea. They're going to take notice. They're going to kick you out. Um, they tightened up the ship, and that's why you see a lot of things changing with affiliate marketing uh, because there's a lot of people out there ruining it for us. So I want to show you guys how to do it the right way. All right, so the number one mistake is everyone's trying to serve everybody. Um, after this training today, you guys are going to get super clear about how this works. All right, so today I want you to think about this. Who can I serve and what problem can I solve for them? I'm going to show you guys a ton of examples today. Um, of di different people taking what they know, their knowledge, even if they're just starting out and, and focusing on that niche. All right, so this is going to help you guys. Um, I call this my uh, level 10. If you guys haven't heard of a level 10 idea, um, a lot of people talk about this in the industry. And your level 10 idea is like your big life purpose, like the big idea that you're we're all after. And I don't want you to focus there because that that will It'll literally drive you insane and you'll never get anything accomplished if you're always just trying to figure it out. It's going to come when it's ready. I think somebody today uh, said, um, when you're ready, the teacher appears. That's kind of funny. But um, I'll tell you guys a quick story. Um, so last year, I was honored by getting invited to ClickFunnels headquarters and we were put up in a lake house with the top 10 ClickFunnels affiliates uh, for the One Funnel Away Challenge. We got to meet Russell Brunson. We got to all hang out for the weekend. We had three meals catered a day. We were out there on jet skis and boats, and it was awesome. Um, everyone there is their rock stars. These guys know their level 10 ideas or they're on their way. And I'm sitting there, and Stephen Larson just presented, and he goes, um, if you have an affiliate marketing business, you don't have a real business. And I was crushed. I like literally went to my room and like sobbed. They're like, where's Doug? He's supposed to be sharing his biggest uh, takeaway from the weekend with everybody. You know, everyone's sharing the biggest takeaway. So I come out of my room. I'm the last one to go. I'm sitting up there crying in front of like my idols and people that I respect so much. And they're like, what's wrong? I'm like, I don't know. I just feel like I don't know my big idea. You know, Stephen Larson's the offer guy. Russell's the sales funnel guy. And I'm over here just selling uh, click funnels. And they go, no, whoa, 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 slow down. Like, look where you are, number one. Um, and they're calling it the passion crisis. I was having the passion crisis. 
and it's okay. Like we just have to understand and know where we're at and have an idea of where we're going. And when you're doing the things right now, it's going to show up. The next thing is going to show its face. So we have to start sometimes at a level one. So for example, um, here's where we're going, right? We're going toward our goals and it takes momentum and it takes self-discipline. This isn't instant gratification, guys. What we need is delayed gratification. It's hard as heck sometimes. All right. That's being human. I get it. But when you could um, put off that instant gratification and work towards this, your life is going to change. I promise you. So quick lesson today. Um, here's my level one, guys. It's your job. Uh, I worked in sales, uh, doing door to door, 100 percent commission jobs. I've done it all. Phone sales, you name it. Um, it wasn't enough. I was good. I was top ranked in the company. I still wasn't making enough to cover my bills. Imagine that. Um, so I worked in a restaurant, I worked uh, in re different restaurant positions. So that's my level one idea. So like, what's your level one idea? Like, let me know below. Like, what's, what are you guys doing for work right now? If you're not full time online yet, it's okay. If you're at level one, I, it's seriously okay. Like you're going to learn some skills in this job. I realized I like helping the restaurant with marketing. I, I built out their website. I built out their funnels. Um, I gained some skills, right? They let me uh, experiment a little bit with their website. So the next thing started to show itself. Guess what I started doing? Um, affiliate marketing, multi-level marketing. I, I was selling other people's products. All right. And that's okay because why go out there and try to create your own products and services when you're still trying to figure it all out by being an affiliate or selling somebody else's products and services. That's already amazing that you already uh, align with They're you know, again, real, um, relatable. You could earn with them that you align to their mission and values. Um, they're long term, right? So um, go and do that first, and the next thing is going to show itself. I gained a ton of skills promoting multi-level marketing, offline and online marketing over the years. All right, then I did this. I said, okay, now I know some skills. I'm going to go sell websites. I'm going to do websites and funnels for businesses. All right, and then I realized I can make and, and help people um, with this too because after I, started, I was selling websites, you guys know my story. I realized I don't want to work with clients. You know, I was tired of chasing clients around for content and, and checks, and I didn't want to hire a team to help me um, scale an agency. So I said, you know what? What do I like? Again, the next thing started to present itself. It said, well, you know, I like the affiliate commissions coming in from the software that I'm referring my clients. Um, well, next step is how can I get a hundred referrals to ClickFunnels? So I created a course. I found a gap. We're going to go over this, guys. I'm just looking for gaps to fill in the marketplace. I noticed the gap. There's a hundred thousand ClickFunnels users. Only like 700 and something of them have hit um, the two comma club, which is a million in revenue, which is amazing. But how do we increase that? How do we get more people profitable with ClickFunnels? So I noticed the gap that people are paying for ClickFunnels, but they're not making money with it. And that's what I'm here to fill right now. I want to guide people online to make their first dollars online because I wish I had that when I first started. So then my for my free course was created, Sales Funnel Mastery. I'm currently um, launching 2.0. All right. Uh, it's going to be simpler. It's going to be more realistic. It's going to be step by step what people want. I've been told what people want over the year. I'm doing this and now I'm, I'm making it perfect. We're close to it. All right, next one was Dream Car Accelerator. Like, take what you've done and go teach people how to do it. So I hit the Dream Car. Um, I have a high ticket program called Dream Car Accelerator. It's currently closed right now. I'm working with uh, 22 amazing rock stars that are going to walk stage with me at Funnel Hacking Live 2021. And I can't wait to present the opportunity to those of you guys who want to join that later on. Um, if you want to be a Dream Car winner uh, and you're focused on ClickFunnels Affiliate, let me know in the comments. Give me a hashtag Dream Car. All right, I want to see how many of you guys want to walk stage uh, Final Hacking Live 2021. Uh, give me a hashtag dream car. All right, I'd love to know which of you guys are, are, are after that goal. And 100 users in ClickFunnels, guys, is not that difficult. You're going to get to walk stage with me again uh, in 2021 and collect your trophy. We're going to get an awesome picture together. We're going to hang out. It's probably the best event of the year. I love going to Final Hacking Live. Hopefully, if the, the world's back in order by then. But um, I, I have high hopes for it. I have faith. Um, all right. So next thing um, is starting to, now I'm, I'm building out these things. I'm like, where am I do? Where, where am I meant to be in this industry? Like, where can I carve out my place? And I noticed there's thousands of course creators and coaches teaching how to build out courses, but no one's really teaching people with courses how to go out there and leverage it by creating partnerships, doing joint ventures, creating affiliate programs, um, doing collaborations. Like I'm in the collaborative space. I know that's where I'm going. So that's starting to show its face. I don't know what it looks like yet, 
but I have a title for it. It's called Passive Partnerships. That's probably next year. I don't even know what I'm going to do with that yet. However, like when you come up with like um, six and seven and eight, like I have no idea what these next steps are. I don't know. Like, you know, if I were to, you know, let's someone said, um, if you were to leave this world tomorrow, what would you want to be known for? It's certainly not teaching sales funnels. No offense. It's, it's where I'm getting my start, but um, we're here to do more. But what I'm doing right now is I'm impacting you guys. Like I see, by the way, like this is awesome. I got to shout out. Um, somebody yesterday told me they had their son on who's only 13 years old um, and they had their kids watching along. So that excites me. Like that is so awesome that they're learning these skills. So like what I'm doing right now, I mean, not to discredit sales funnels, but like I'm giving people the tools they need to go out there and have success online. And it's changing those parents' lives and those, there's gonna be their kids and their grandkids. And like, that's why I keep going. All right. So if you guys have any kids watching uh, right now, let me know in the comments. I want the, the kids to connect. I know, um, I forget who it was now. I'm slipping my mind, but he said he had his son and he'd love to know if there's other kids watching along. So bring your families, bring your kids into this. This is awesome stuff um, that's going to really help, help change their lives, help them start a business as a teenager. Like I wish I could have done that. All right. I was out there. I had paper routes and stuff like that. <laughs> uh, lemonade stands, you know, the, the young entrepreneurial stuff. It's all about impact. Very true. All right, cool. All right, guys. So the whole purpose of this is I don't want you to freak out if you don't know like your big idea. It's totally okay. All right. It's really okay if you don't know your, your big idea yet. But by doing the first thing and making that first step, whether it's affiliate or launching your own products or services, um, the next thing's going to start to show its face. It's going to keep showing and it's really okay if you don't know your purpose. So today I want you guys to take action, come up with one idea that you could just put together a free course for, even if you don't do anything with this course. All right. Maybe it's going to be the first step you need to find what you actually want to do and who you want to serve. Like pick one idea. And if you don't have any ideas after this training today, um, let's just figure out how we could promote ClickFunnels because there's an amazing opportunity here. You guys saw the numbers yesterday that I was putting up. Um, you know, year and a uh, year and a few months ago, I was dead broke, negative in the bank, working as a server. All right, and you guys have seen me make multiple six figures uh, since then by just promoting one product. That's ClickFunnels. All right. So it works and I did no paid traffic, all right? I grew this group from zero people, well, one, myself, to over 6,000 now. Like, you guys got this, I promise you, okay? So um, I hope this gives you guys a little bit of clarity about you don't have to know your big idea, your, your purpose yet, but just start somewhere and it's gonna show its face. Let's talk about the obstacle is the way, because this helped me. Um, I was taking the One Funnel Away Challenge about a year and a half ago and um, it inspired me to quit my job. <laughs> Um, so who can you help most if only you spoke your truth? All right. I hear this all the time. My accent, I have no results. Um, just starting out, no skills, too much competition. Well, that's limited scarcity mindset. It's baloney, malarkey. All right. Um, just yesterday I had somebody come to me and they say, Hey, I'm in Belgium and, um, no one's doing this in my country. And I want to teach exactly what you've done in my own language. I'm like, yes, finally, somebody who gets it. Because I've had people come to me and say, hey, I'm from um, this little country, my accent, I can't do this. I'm like, why not just teach this in your own language to your people? Like, oh, they don't get it. Well, how do you meet them where they're at and bridge that gap? How do we bridge that gap and show them the way, right? Oh, my country's too small. How many people are there? Oh, a couple million. That's, that's plenty of people. All you need is 100 people, 100 people, guys to sign up to ClickFunnels and you're, and you're making great income. That's going to give you the time and the space to go out there and realize what you want to do in this life. When you're not working a job all the time, when you're not miserable uh, servicing and building someone else's dream. All right, cool. Here's some of my life obstacles, guys. Um, growing up without money in a broken home, uh, getting into $114,000 of debt without a degree. That sucked. Failing 27 times online for the past eight years, paying thousands of dollars, wasted money. Buying courses like that, I don't even know what I wanted to do. I'm buying courses on e-commerce. I'm buying courses on agency. Uh, you name it, I've bought courses on it, all right? Um, and why do we have to spend so much money just to figure out what we need, what we want to do? Like, that's not what I want. So I wanted to find out how can I help people for free figure out what they want to do, all right? And I hope it's going to help. Um, Working three jobs and still failing to pay bills. No one should be working three jobs and failing to pay their bills. I get so pissed off at this because you know what? That's what the world's at right now. They're having us slave away, working, working, working. We're missing opportunities to spend time with family and we can't even pay our damn bills. And like, I get so heated about this. 
Um, and maybe it's my own fault. Maybe I just had the wrong mindset and I could totally agree with that. All right. But what I can do is speak to these obstacles. These obstacles came to me for a reason. And now I can speak my truth and admit these things, admit my wrongs and show people an easier way. Um, because now through telling these stories, I'm finding people who are resonating with them. They're like, Hey, me too. Like I'm there. Like, you know, now I meet them where they're at and show them how I could help them because it helped me over the last 18 months. So who am I speaking to in my marketing? I'm speaking to other people failing online. Um, people who have tons of debt, people who are working in the service industry, uh, whether it's, you know, working in a salon or a restaurant, like working with people is hard. <laughs> um, maybe people who have failed at multi-level marketing like myself in the past. So like when I start showing up and admitting fault in the past and, and, and documenting that experience and talking about it, I start to attract people that I know I could help because I've overcome all this. So the obstacle is the way. I'm gonna show you guys some um, examples here right now. If you guys don't know Colton Crowdinger, he's the man good friend of mine who we met through this community in ClickFunnels and we've, we've hung out at Funnel Hacking Live and other events. So Colton started out, he didn't know his level 10 idea. He had no clue, but he started out in an opportunity online. He's another one. He's gone through a lot of opportunities. Um, he started a free course, just like I'm teaching you guys right now. He's the one who inspired me to really start this journey of my free course, him and a few other people. That free course helped him hit dream car status. And all he was doing was sharing a little bit of bits and knowledge and resources he was using to be successful online. And um, now through that, like this is like fast forward a couple of years, he now is the founder of Anxiety Hackers. He helps people with anxiety. Why? Because he came forward with his truth and said, I have anxiety and I'm not afraid to um, admit it anymore. And I'm going to help others by speaking my truth. He's got Facebook groups in like the, I think it's like 80,000 plus people in between his three Facebook groups. Amazing, amazing stuff. And he's just helping people overcome their anxiety now because again, he spoke his truth. Uh, we have Sandra. All right. Sandra has gone through some things in life that I wouldn't wish on anybody. And uh, she's owning it. Now she speaks to that truth and she's helping people overcome trauma uh, through her stories. So again, like the obstacle is the way, because when you start being vocal about the things that happen to you and then you're learning and you're experiencing and now you're growing because of it, they're going to find you like your dream clients are going to say, Hey, me too. I want to, I want to work with you because you've experienced this. All right, my buddy Matt, I saw Matt on earlier, Matt Gady, my buddy from hometown Wallen for Connecticut. We hung out at Phone Hacking Live this year. I brought him down there and he's on a new journey. He quit his job. Uh, he started Escape from Debt, all right? The obstacles away. Matt had a ton of debt just like myself. He paid it off, I think, in 13 months, $60,000. He paid off in 13 months. Matt, if you're watching, correct me if I'm wrong on those numbers, but he did it. All right, how nice would it be to be getting out of multiple uh, five or six figures of debt in, in less than a year or two? pretty damn amazing, you know, and he's now taken that obstacle where it's probably hard to talk about like debt and things like that. And now he's encouraging other people to escape from debt. And this is his group. All right. Escape from debt. Check him out. Now he's speaking his truth and helping people get out of debt. Pretty amazing. So um, what I want to talk about is competition versus collaborate, uh, collaboration. So again, a lot of you guys um, starting out think that you have to go out there and compete but we, if we just collaborate together, we could go so much further, so much faster. All right. And I'm going to take you guys on a little exercise right now that's going to help you understand this concept. So um, imagine a world where we all collaborate instead of compete and we refer people to each other. Like, oh, wow, you're struggling with debt. Oh, hey, you should talk to my buddy, Matt. Like, let's refer people. Let's send people to other people. Like, it's okay if I lose a ClickFunnels sign up or someone to buy my program if it's not a match. I'd rather have them with the right person because I know that person's going to send people to me. Um, and I've, I've adopted this into my business practices. And now I send people to, I said, like a few guys watching right now, you guys have known, I've got, Hey, you should check out this person. Like in my conversations with you, when you join this group, if you're not a fit or there's someone could help you better, I'm going to send you that to them. And it's because they're sending people back to me now tenfold. You know, I saw Tori Bannock on here earlier. Um, her husband, Jeffrey, he's awesome. Um, he sends me people all the time. He actually helped me like realize I need to, um, step into the affiliate world and be the affiliate marketer for click funnels i was i was ashamed to announce that uh, a year ago and after have a conversation with him at offermind he changed that perspective why because in my mind affiliate marketing was shady business like but it's because people are doing it the wrong way why not go out and be the person to teach people how to do it the right way and that's what i've stepped into so thank you jeffrey for watching or tori um appreciate you guys all right so here's an example all right i want you guys to find a, a gap what gap can you fill in your industry, in your niche, in what you're doing? 
Uh, for example, um, I help, who do you help? Insert that, uh, insert the result they want without the pain or obstacle. All right, I'm gonna give you guys a few examples of this here in a minute, um, but this exercise will help you guys understand who you could help and what pain you could solve for them. Um, and once you figure that out, I want you to ask yourself, who has audiences of people who could refer people to me who don't want to teach X, Y, and Z? Like whoever, like for example, actually I'll show you guys here. I don't want to confuse you guys. Um, what are the people doing online before they need what you're teaching? All right, what are they doing before you? All right, and then the second question is, what are they doing after? Who can I send people to in hopes that people are going to send people to me before? All right, I'm going to put this into example so you guys could actually make this uh, connection real quick. All right. Very cool. So if you guys are watching this right now live, go back and, and watch this and do this tonight as you're doing your homework assignment. Go back to this slide. I want you guys to understand this. Uh, what is the gap that you could fill? That's all I did. I found a gap and here's how it looks. Um, well, let's talk about network marketing first. Well, here's the gap with network marketing. And I'm just saying this. Um, old school marketing tactics like the three-way call and targeting family and friends doesn't work it does not work it burns friends and, and kills relationships um, so what can your statement be I help network marketers make six figures in their business without relying on friends and family so if you look up here I help blank call them out insert the result that they want without the pain so I help network marketers make six figures in their business without relying on family and friends if you guys know your your statement put it below put it in the comments I would love to know uh, who you guys are helping and what problem you're helping them solve um, we're gonna get you guys all here today I know it all right um, and then now you're asking yourself who has audience of people who uh, could refer people to me that don't want to teach X Y and Z uh, what are people doing before uh, they need what I'm doing. All right. So the second question is who has audience of people that I can refer people to after they've gone through my training? So for example, like where are you going to find people? Who's congregating your clients already, your future customers? Um, network marketing companies, network marketing groups, uh, network marketing social media channels, right? Go and find your dream avatar. Get super active in those groups on that YouTube channel. Comment, engage, Instagram, whatever you're doing social media wise, go find out where they're congregating. Go become and, and just shake them up a little bit. Throw out those hooks. Um, sales jobs, door to door people. These, these people are hungry. They're working 100% commission already. Um, that's where I started. That's why I started doing network marketing because I wanted more. Uh, people selling ClickBank offers. They're just selling garbage, you know, half the time. Not to say they're all garbage, but most of the time. Uh, these people are promoting thing after thing after thing. They look like me of, like four years ago, and I was just selling 10 things at a time because I, I was just hoping to make sure one sticks and none did. Um, people feeling lost online, 90% of people. People in service industry, like restaurant workers, salon, like we're hustlers. Like I know from experience, we're type A. We, wanna, we, want, we want more in life. And um, maybe we're comfortable in our restaurant jobs, but we need someone like you to come out and say, hey, there's a better way. All right. Follow people like Eric Worre or Ray Higdon. These guys are dominating the space. They're already congregating your customers. Go go join their groups. Ray Higdon has a paid Facebook group. It's like seven bucks a month. Totally worth it to pay seven bucks a month to have access to your dream clients. All right. Go create relationships. Um, who has audience of people I can refer to after they've gone through my training? Like what things can you sell or send people to to make affiliate commissions? Um, can you sell your own products, your own service that you eventually create? Um, for example, click funnels, right? Help them create a funnel for their network marketing business that they could, they could give to their downline. They could give to hundreds of other people in that business that will pay them um, and, and, and sign up to click funnels with them in exchange for a funnel template that's working. The one funnel away challenge, you can put them through OFA challenge, $100 per profit per sale. Um, course creators you could partner with. Um, for example, guys, like when I first started, I knew a little bit, but I didn't, I wasn't the expert in design. I wasn't the expert in agency. I wasn't the expert in e-commerce um, or courses. So I partnered with a few people. I partnered with Catherine Jones and I would educate people a little bit and then I'd send them to her. She pays me a 50% commission split when I send her a referral. Same thing with uh, Peter Pru. He teaches e-commerce. I partnered with him. He's the best in the ClickFunnels space teaching e-commerce. All right. So when people come to me and they're like, oh, I don't really want to do affiliate. I want to do e-commerce. I'm like, oh, Peter Pru's your guy. I get a I get a commission from him. So like, who else can you partner with? What coaches? I think I spelled the couches. Don't partner with couches, guys. That's not good. What coaches can you partner with? All right. Hashtag imperfect action. 
All right, ClickFunnels, let's talk about this. Uh, this is MySpace. So um, what is the gap I noticed? It's over 100,000 users, but only 800 have made a million. And like maybe a couple thousand have actually profited with it. So I'm filling that gap. I'm, I'm respecting ClickFunnels and Russell Brunson. They have an amazing thing, but they don't have the time to go and service the new person who's brand, brand new. So I'm filling that gap. I'm filling that gap between brand new person online and the expert who understands the tech of ClickFunnels. There's a gap there. I know ClickFunnels is easy to use once you learn it, but to me, I, I don't think that there was an easy way to find out those tutorials. So I created those tutorials. I gave them away for free. I bridged the gap, all right? And, and look, at it, it really helped me, all right? Um, so example, I help aspiring entrepreneurs make six figures online without creating and selling their own products and services to start out. Right. A lot of people are telling these newbies to go out and create their own products and run ads and buy solo ads. And, oh, I just want to shake them. I want to throw rocks at them, not to hurt them, but just to like, you know, get them a little scared. Like, I don't like people teaching my people these things that aren't working. I don't like I was that person. I was that person. People were telling me to go buy solo ads. I spent thousands of dollars on ads trying to figure it out. Solo ads, garbage, garbage, garbage. Don't do them. I don't care. I don't care how good you think your solo ads are. It's not your traffic. Go build your own list. Don't pay anybody for solo ads. I'm just saying I will, I will beat that with a bat all day long. Waste of money. Um, I, so I want to help aspiring entrepreneurs make six figures without all that garbage. Call them out, call them out. Um, so I asked myself, who has audience of people who could refer people to me who don't want to teach the beginners? What are people doing before they need what I'm doing? And now you guys probably see my name. I get uh, tagged all the time on Facebook uh, and social media saying, oh, we got to go check out Doug Bowen because I came known as that person. And I want you guys to become known as your person and in your space. All right. Um, so who am I looking for? I'm looking for course creators. Uh, if someone goes to a course creator, and they don't even know how to use ClickFunnels. They're going to say, hey, go check out Doug Bowden. Um, coaches, I'm just going to lay these all out. There's a lot. So I've identified all the people who don't want to teach beginners, and I want them to send them people to me. Because guess what I'm going to do? Once I educate them enough, I'm going to send them people so that they're – so we have a, a good partnership where I'm giving them a commission for referring people to me, and they're giving me a commission when I send people to them. All right. It's very collaborative. And I want you guys to get in the mindset of collaborations. All right. Very powerful stuff. It's it's literally how you could go from making your first dollar online to making your first million. Um, and don't be greedy. Give us give some of it away. Give 40, 50 percent commissions to people sending referrals. Very powerful. It's how you see a lot of people in the two comic club doing it. All right. Let's talk about non um online related stuff. Let's talk about real estate. Let's talk about niching down. Uh, what is your expertise? What have you been doing online or offline or online? Um, let's talk about real estate, for example. Uh, what is the gap? All right, so you're a real estate professional. There's a gap there. Realtors aren't even making enough money to do it full time. They're literally doing it as a side hustle. You know how much money there's potentially to make in real estate if you do it the right way? A lot. But most of them don't know that way. So um, find the gap. Help realtors stop buying bull crap leads, right? You're buying leads that aren't any good um, from Trulia and uh, other websites. Teach them how to get their own leads using sales funnels. You can find 100 real estate agents very quickly that will adopt your funnel. So I ask you, who has audiences of people who could refer people to me who don't want to teach beginners? What are they people doing before they am what I'm doing? All right, so they're buying leads from Zillow, Trulia, Realtor.com. These leads are garbage. They're they're sold to many different realtors. They're all getting contacted. All right, they're probably annoyed by the time you even reach out to them. So how can we solve that? We could create an online sales funnel that's going to educate them how to get their own leads. Right? Uh, maybe you could join real estate groups and social media channels or, or the podcasts, like the blogs. There's so many different things. Every niche has these channels that are already gathering your customers. Go in and and see how you could partner or collaborate or um, even and build relationships from there. Um, who has audiences that you can refer people to after? Maybe you have um, real estate coaches you could partner with. If you don't want a coach, you just want to give the funnel, uh, teach them how to use the funnel, and then send them all to your way. Like Find a real estate coach that you could partner with is when you send people to them, um, they'll give you a commission. Or you create your own coaching program around helping real estate agents make more money online, get better clients using sales funnels. All right, this works for any niche. Uh, lawyers, uh, contractors. Uh, by the way, I don't know if my brother is watching right now, but my brother, I hope I'm, uh, I hope he doesn't mind me sharing. I think he's pretty tough, so he doesn't care. But um, he is like, 
he's doing this thing right now, you guys. He started a Facebook group. He's already at almost 200 people in his Facebook group in like a few weeks. He did this like two weeks ago. Um, he's using online marketing. He's offline. He's gone door to door in the past trying to find clients and, and referrals. He's now online and he's booked out solid, guys. He started a Facebook group. And, um, you know, just a little about his past. He doesn't have a college degree, never even finished high school. You know, he spent some time away, he locked up, he's done some things, he's learned from his mistakes. And now he's here doing things that he thought he could never do. Because society says, if you don't have a GDE, or if you don't have um, a college degree, you can't do this. Now he's crushing it in business. All right, because he's done these things. He, he's creating a sales funnel now. He's running uh, local ads to generate business for himself. Guess what he's gonna do now that he's mastered that for himself? He's booked out for months and months. He's hiring a team. Um, and he's a contractor, it's offline. He's gonna go out and teach other contractors how to do this. So he's still gonna do what he does best, but why not share that knowledge, all right? He could find 100 contractors, set them up with a ClickFunnels account and be a dream car winner this year. He's gonna do it. My brother, pretty amazing stuff. You guys could do this, I promise you. Um, by the way, he even owned a lab cop two weeks ago. So <laughs> just saying, uh, if he could do it, you could do it. No offense to him. He's he's smart, brilliant kid, but when it comes to tech, he's not there. But now he, he's doing the impossible in his own mind. So I'm, I'm just proud of him. Uh, questions invite revelation, all right? So if you are that person, like we mentioned at the beginning of this training, that has too many ideas, like myself when I first started, um, I want to ask you, this is the question I was asked by Stephen Larson during the One Final Way Challenge. If you have a lot of ideas, what would you rather be known for, all right? At the time, I was building out a course to help people get out of debt and fix their credit. And I realized I don't want to talk about that every day. Um, but building out that course taught me so much about course creation and marketing. Um, but when it came down to it, I had to choose that or ClickFunnels affiliate. And um, at the time, like I was starting this Facebook group. I also had a group for my course, uh, my, my debt relief community. And I didn't want to focus on two things. You, you know, what's the saying? You chase two rabbits, you don't get one. So um, I asked myself, what would I rather be known for? What would I rather talk about and create content around and help people with? And that's ClickFunnels because I know if they can make money with ClickFunnels, they could pay off those debts. You know, it doesn't even, that's the bottom line. So I want you guys to ask yourself uh, on the homework sheet tonight, you're going to be asked these questions. If you still don't know, I want you to think long and hard about this. You know, what did you go to school for? What do you have experience in? What do you do professionally right now? What do you like about that? What do you hate about it? Maybe that will help you. Um, what else have you done in the past? Like maybe you had an awesome job and career that you changed to make more money with something else that you don't, you're not as passionate about. Think about what the, what you've done over your life like as a kid, a teenager, an adult. What do you like most about that job? What types of questions do family and friends ask you about? Do you have any hobbies or interests? Like what makes you different? Um, what are you doing when you feel most alive? For me, it's coaching. I love this. Like you guys see the excitement in my voice right now. Like I love teaching. I love instructing and helping you guys. Um, what can you talk about for hours without any problem? Uh, what could you teach about every single day? What life experiences have you been through that you've overcome? This one's huge. Again, obstacle is the way. What life experiences have you overcome that you're a step ahead of others that you could teach? Guys, I'm no millionaire. I'm no like guru. I'm I'm one step ahead of you guys. Some maybe you guys aren't even that far behind me. I'm like a, a year ahead probably. All right, you guys got this. All right, experience I've overcome. I've overcome a lot of experience in this industry, struggling, and I want to give you guys a shortcut. This is it. This five day workshop is really going to help. Who can you help most by speaking your truth? That's who. You, that's your who. Uh, quick hint: your dream avatar is probably you a year ago, you a month ago, you two years ago. That's my, my dream avatar is a person working a job that's struggling and, and, and scared to quit because they don't have anyone to show them the way. That's my dream avatar. I'm going, I'm trying to help that person push them onto that path, like I said yesterday. So ask yourself these questions. It's going to give you guys some ideas. Narrow it down and then start asking yourself, what would you rather be known for? And then do that thing. Cool? Hope that helps, guys. All right. So tonight, I want you to write down all the things that come to mind. Uh, I spelled this wrong again, imperfect action, hashtag imperfect action. <laughs> Let this exercise help uh, name your course. All right, so here's what it looks like. I give you guys a bunch of space here. If you need more, use a journal, do something else. Um, and I want you to write down all these things that are coming to mind and come up with three names of your course. All right, come up with three names for your course. If you guys wanna put it as a vote in this group, feel free, but make sure it's done by midnight. I really need you guys to uh, complete the homework by midnight. And all I want you guys to do, I'm giving you guys a lot of tasks, so let me create some confusion. 
the workbook and the homework, um, it's, it's always more than the task I'm actually giving you. So the task on the homework post is usually just like, like today it's name your, what's the name of your course? That's going to show me you did the homework. All right. So um, you don't have to post this in the group or anything like that. If you don't want to, I just want you to post the one thing I'll show you guys here in a minute, but there's homework um, sheets. I want you to complete, but the task itself is just post posting um, the one question I have for you each day. All right. So do this, come up with your name um, and guys, don't worry about making this perfect. I don't care. I want to see just as many people yesterday completing the homework as uh, today. So uh, I think we had almost 700 people complete the homework. I want another 700 people completing the homework today. Don't let this stupid name hold you back. Go, go make something up. Put it there. It's not your forever name. It's not your forever idea. It's going to change. It's going to evolve. I just want you to take imperfect action. Cool. So uh, let's talk about naming your course for those of you guys who don't even know who you're going to serve or what problem you're going to solve yet. Um, when you figure that part out, um, you're going to want to use keywords and the goal uh, that your course, the goal of your customer, what is their goal? Have that in the course title. What speaks to your dream customer? What is their desire? Let's give you guys some examples. Who here likes real life examples? Did that help you guys yesterday, by the way? Cool. Karina, I have so much to think about. Yes, yes. Just do the task one question at a time tonight. and I promise you, you'll have some breakthroughs. Yes, can it be a work in progress? I want it to be. You guys, by the way, I want this course to suck when you're done on, after five days. I want it to be the worst course ever. But guess what? You have it done, and now you know the process, and you can go take the next few weeks to make it even better. Um, and with my help, I'm actually going to give you guys an opportunity to let me help you make it even better All right, on day five. So stay tuned. Um, I'm going to help so many of you guys. I can't wait. All right, um, so let's talk about naming your course. Who wants real-life examples? Here's a blank example. <laughs> course name, keywords that your dream customer resonates with. All right. So mine is actually, I'll show you mine in a minute. Number one, this is what your course is going to look like. It's five videos. Why video? Because you want them to know, like, and trust you. You want to do the things that other people aren't willing to do. So when I made my free course, I noticed everyone has courses, but no one's getting on video. That's what put me uh, ahead of the curve and people to like, see how I teach and repel people that don't like the way I teach. That's okay. Let it repel them. If they don't like my spelling errors, then they got to go because guess what? I, I take imperfect action. I'm not, I'm not going to be perfect. All right. I used to be perfect. I didn't get anything done. I never made any money online because I was trying to be perfect. So now I'd rather have people call me out for my spelling errors. <laughs> I appreciate that, by the way. I do appreciate when you guys tell me I got errors because I go I go fix them, but I, I'm open to that. All right, so number one, uh, here's your first video in your free course, guys. Um, who are you and what's in it for them? The people watching, what's in it for them? Who are you and what's in it for them? Your second video is what does your customer already know? This could be one video too, two or three. It could be, it could be four videos, right? You could kind of combine these two. I just want to make sure that they're separate uh, uh, so you get it. But what does your customer already know? Websites probably, right? How can we bridge the gap? Uh, if you're a real estate agent, what do they already know? They already know that they're buying offline leads or they're doing old school marketing. Meet them there and bridge the gap and show them the new way, the new opportunity. Uh, and then show them how this will work for them. Like show this exactly how it's going to work for them. Walk them through a sales funnel so they get it. And their mind goes, whoa, okay, I need a sales funnel. By video four, you want them to say, I need a sales funnel. Guess what they need, guys? They need click funnels. All right. And then the next video is going to be, here's what I have to offer you if you buy click funnels with my link. Here's what I have to offer you if you buy one funnel away challenge with my link to help you build this funnel. Here's what I'm going to offer you when you buy my own course or my program. All right. So you guys, video five is your conversion piece. We're going to go over conversion content on Thursday. All right. So right now I just want you guys to uh, map this out. Don't worry about what you're going to say in these videos. All I want you to come up with is the title of your course and the title of these videos, just so we can map out those pieces. So we can put the skeleton together tomorrow so we can actually build your course. All right. I'm going to show you guys what it looks like here in a minute. Here's my course. All right. Sales funnel mastery, five ways to monetize click funnels. Um, People that read this know exactly what I'm doing. If they don't know ClickFunnels, then they're going to find out. Um, so it's the goal. They want to make money with ClickFunnels. Sales Funnel Mastery. I get people joining my, my group and my course all the time. I ask them, how'd you find my course? Or how'd you find my group? And they go, oh, I, I looked up Sales Funnels. Or I looked up ClickFunnels. Because it's in my course name, they're finding it. right? So if you're teaching real estate agents, 
call them out. Real estate agent mastery, real estate agent secrets. I don't know. You know, come up with your mine was pretty generic. Now you see mastery everywhere. I don't care. The name doesn't really care matter. It just makes sure you have keywords in it and that it flows. All right. And here's my video structure, my free course. All right. My video, by the way, my course right now, I'm doing this along with you guys. I'm redoing my full, my free course this week because I realized mine has way too much information and it's not set up to convert. It's not set up. It's, it's set up to get people in and learn, but it's not actually giving them the next step uh, a little bit, but I want to make it better by making it easier. Five videos, five videos. My first video, welcome to sales funnel mastery. Who am I and why you should care? Video number two is What's a sales funnel? Well, I compare it to a website. You know what a website is, right? Well, here's how this works. It's a little bit different. Video number three, I build out a, a, a funnel from scratch so they really, really understand how easy this is. Video number four, I show them five different ways they can now make money with sales funnels. And then video number five, I help them choose one idea and get started with it. Here's how you get started. Come join me in Sales Funnel Mastery 2.0. All right, I sell my program. All right. And then, of course, I sell my affiliate links everywhere. Click funnels at the top up here. Click here to get click funnels. Click here to buy one funnel away challenge. Click here to get active campaign. All right. So you can sprinkle your affiliate links here. And again, even if you're not doing click funnels, go partner with a company that that will pay you a percentage for sending them referrals or find software that's going to help um, your dream customer. Um, maybe you find for real estate agents, you find an awesome software that helps them CRM or some kind of tool. Um, maybe you find a coach that you could refer people to and they give you, uh, 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 commissions. You don't have to create your own stuff right away, guys. You don't have to do it. Go make commissions from sending it to other people's trainings. Again, this works for any online business, offline business. It doesn't matter. This could work. Cool. Let's talk about some other examples. Um, this is my good friend, Dawn Fleming. All right. Uh, she look, let me talk about niching down and collaborating, right? Now, when I find people that are a little bit older than me, they probably, you know, think I talk too fast. I do. I know I'm going to send this to Dawn. Hey, like you should go check out Dawn and then she's going to send people to me and it's a beautiful collaboration. All right. So let's just talk about her free course called, um, live and earn anywhere over 50. Pretty clear, right? She's calling out her avatar. People over 50 live and earn anywhere. She's niching down. She's not working with anybody and everybody. And that's why she's going to succeed. That's why she's going to hit dream car status this year. She's going to get over 100 people working with her. Cool. Um, here's the lesson names. Meet your captain. Who am I? Why should you care? Number two, overhead to open seas, right? With If you're having a lot of overhead owning a business right now and you can't travel, here's how you could actually hit the open seas and go and travel while having a business online. So meet them where they're at, bring them to fill that gap. Uh, number three, blinded uh, from blindsided to prosperity. She's going to tell her story about how she was blindsided over and over and over and how she actually started to be prosperous. And then she's going to teach them the same way how to do it. And then number four, here's your next destination. Come with me. I'm going to show you how you need this, you need this or this. She's selling products. Uh, let's talk about Justin. Justin's another one of my clients. Uh, Real online marketing secret, sales funnel, and email marketing mastery. By the way, guys, there's so many things you could teach on the digital marketing space. It doesn't have to be the sales funnels. Maybe you're an awesome copywriter and you want to teach people how to write emails that convert. You get 100 people signed up to Active Campaign or uh, MailChimp or AWeb or one of those that, if they have an affiliate program. It doesn't have to be ClickFunnels. So take what you know and go and create a free course. Bridge that gap. Introduction. Um, Real Online Marketing Explained. How this can work for you. Next best steps. See the pattern here, guys? I'm going to start going a little bit faster through some of these. Um, Jade Reese, rock star. Passion to Profit. Her course is called Passion to Profit, Digital Marketing Success for LGBTQ Entrepreneurs. She calls out her avatar. All right. Watch this first. The Open Closet. Tools and Tips. Let's get started. Just coming up with her, her course name and her video, her first few videos to get them going. Real cool, right? Jade Reese. Um, passive income for overworked parents. Again, calling out the, the niche down avatar. Overworked parents, passive income. Who's this for? It's for people that want to make passive income and they feel overworked. So feeling overworked, I got you. Who's here, who's, here's who I am and why you should care. Starting online business. Here's some strategies and tips. Here's some tools and resources. Uh, work less and balance your life. All right. Uh, you deserve quality time. All right. Come and get it. I'm going to show you how. We have Bobby. All right. Bobby's teaching YouTube. All right. Again, you could take one thing and teach it. It's so interesting. Like if uh, you just find that one thing that you can you could get to learn and master and then and go and teach it. 
marketing and traffic strategies for online entrepreneurs using YouTube. People reading that know who it's for. It's for online entrepreneurs who want to use YouTube to succeed. All right, uh, meet your producer. Why YouTube? Your first video, rank on YouTube, take it to the next level, buy my course, buy my program, let me coach you. Really cool, right? Um, again, Matt, escape from debt, student loans, credit cards, and financial stress. Uh, number one, your escape planner. Video number two, what's your income? Give them a small win. Um, help them look at their bills, right? What are your expenses? Creating your debt priority list, eliminate expenses. All right, well, here's your escape from debt plan. Come work with me in my, my course. I'm going to help you get out of debt this year or get you well on your way to getting out of debt this year. So here's how it could work even if you're not promoting ClickFunnels, right? A free course could help anybody. What information could you give away to bridge the gap from where they are now to where they want to be? And then get them to know, like, and trust you and then give them a video that's going to convert them and show them the next best step. All right, that's all our free course is doing. It's attracting our leads, nurturing our leads, and then converting all these into dream customers. Cool. Um, let's see, I gotta move this around here. So um, I wanna show you guys what we're building out tomorrow. This is it right here. This is the free course exactly of what I'm gonna give you guys tomorrow. We're gonna build this out. So tonight, I want you guys just to map it out. Name your course, come up with your first, first few lessons, um, by the end of the week, I want your free courses to look like this. Number one, you're going to have your free five lessons, even if you don't film them yet. I'm going to give you guys tools and resources to film this content on Thursday. Um, tomorrow, we're going to build it out. And then Thursday, we're going to film and do those kinds of things. And then Friday, we're going we're to set up the entire plan and, and show you how to fill it with traffic. Does that sound like a plan to you guys? Let me know if you guys are liking this in the comments below. Give me a heart. Give me a like. Let me know what you guys like best so far. But this is what we're building um, tomorrow. So tonight you're gonna map it out. I just want you to name your course, name your lessons, come up with your avatar and who you're gonna serve, what you're probably yourself. Even if it's not your dream customer that you're gonna work permanently with, just pick one, just pick anything. I want you guys just to do this task and, and do complete the homework. So here's how your course is gonna make money, all right? First four videos, you go through them. And by the fifth video, you tell them, hey, like I've got some resources down here. You could start ClickFunnels trial, or you could start this software trial, or you could buy this course. Um, you could get some books, give them books to go read. Um, for people pro and ClickFunnels, we have three different, four different books we could promote using ClickFunnels that people could buy. Um, start building your email list, promote active campaign. Um, the One Funnel Away Challenge, maybe you wanna promote my challenge, right? Um, I'm gonna give you guys an opportunity later this week to promote my next challenge. I'm doing this every six weeks. You guys can make affiliate commissions by sending people to a free workshop. How cool is that? That's up to you, though. You don't have to do that. Um, and then you have a locked mo uh, module down here for when they buy the thing. When they eventually buy the thing that you're promoting on video number five, you're going to have another course area that's locked. Let me show you guys how this actually works. Um, let me pull up a real-life example of this right here. Could you guys see this? Let me know if you could see this, uh, this screen here. All right, this is a real working course area. We're going to build this out tomorrow. All right, tonight we map it out, tomorrow we build it. Cool, here's what it's gonna look like. You're gonna have five video titles. You don't have to build the videos yet, just map them out. Watch this first, how does it work? Real life examples, who uh, who can you help and how can you do this? What's your next best step? Join the One Funnel Away Challenge. So all you guys are doing is attracting, nurturing, and then converting them into, uh, maybe, maybe you don't have an idea of who you wanna work with, um, you just want to help a specific type of person with ClickFunnels. That's the best way to go um, if you don't have your big idea yet. So here they're going to click on this. It's going to bring them to the One Funnel Away Challenge affiliate link. Boom. Now you're going to get someone to sign up. They're going to buy it. You made $100 all from a free course. Um, maybe they sign up to ClickFunnels. So what I want you guys to do tonight is create your ClickFunnels account. Go grab your affiliate links. Tomorrow we're going to be putting those affiliate links into this button here. We're going to put your book uh, affiliate links here for dot-com secrets, expert secrets, traffic secrets, copywriting secrets. Um, we're gonna put your affiliate link for active campaign if you choose to teach that or help people with that. Uh, One Funnel Away Challenge, put your affiliate link here. Freedom Funnel, maybe you wanna promote my next challenge coming up. Uh, we'll talk about how that looks later this week. But um, that's it, guys. You're gonna have your affiliate links here, 30-day challenge, um, click funnels, and again, just, if you're not promoting ClickFunnels or doing something different, just think about what things you could promote. How can you you sell people? Um, let me just show you a quick little thing. Look, oh, it's locked. ClickFunnels sign-up bonuses. Wait, what? I could get bonuses from signing up to ClickFunnels? Cool. Um, I'll show you guys what that looks like. So 
first step first, come up with these first five videos. Um, you could give them a one funnel away challenge link, start making a hundred dollars per sign up. And again, the more traffic you drive to this course, the more sales you're gonna make. Uh, even when you sleep, right? It's all autopilot. You're gonna have people finding this course, joining it and buying from you without you even knowing who they are. Pretty powerful stuff. Um, again, like I just come up with like, for me, I just did some tutorials and uh, I can even uh, give you guys, I'm gonna show you guys how you guys could get this course area right here that it's white labeled later on this week. You can actually uh, import this and uh, send them to a training when they buy ClickFunnels with you. You're gonna be able to unlock this access. So when they click here, it's actually going to bring them to sign up to ClickFunnels. It's going to bring them to your affiliate link. How cool is that? All right. Uh, maybe if you're selling your own, maybe you have your free course down here and you sell your own paid course and you're going to lock that content. Uh, you guys could all do this in ClickFunnels. If you have a, uh, you don't even need the, the expensive plan. All you need is the 97 basic plan to ClickFunnels and it has this feature. Uh, tomorrow, we're going to, we're going to set all this up tomorrow. Right now, I just want you to focus on your course name and the name of your videos here, your titles. So just write those down tonight. Tomorrow, we're gonna to build this out together. It's gonna to be fun. Um, and then we're gonna even show you how to build a graphic just like this from scratch. So when people click on this, the same thing, it brings them to your affiliate link or your core sales page. Uh, if you have a Facebook group, you get people joining your free group. So that's really the goal of this, all right? How nice is that? Everyone excited? <laughs> yeah, I want to give you guys, for those of you guys who, um, you know, want to build out their, these first five videos, but you don't feel fully comfortable building out paid courses or things like that. I have courses I could give you guys. I'm going to talk about that on Friday um, that you guys could give to people when they buy One Funnel Away Challenge from you. I have a course you could give people when they buy ClickFunnels through you that's going to help them succeed with ClickFunnels, actually make money with it. Um, if you have your own course or your paid program, eventually you could link something like this that brings them to your sales page. Again, we build up that sales page in ClickFunnels. Uh, so yeah, I hope that's exciting for you guys. Um, this is what the goal is. That's what we're building out this week. So let's get back to the presentation here. And voila. Cool. So that's what we're building out. Uh, I know it's a lot. I know your mind's probably overwhelmed. Don't worry, guys. We're going to do this one step at a time. Today, we just name our course. We come up with the lessons we want to teach. We grab our affiliate links to ClickFunnels, and we put them in a document so they're ready for tomorrow. Tomorrow, I'm going to show you guys how we create this entire thing, the colors, the buttons, putting in videos, making the module lessons, the, the individual lessons inside the modules, how to create this cool branded um, image here, all from scratch, all for free. Cool, guys. I'm glad you're excited. Uh, Guillermo, great question. Um, let me address that shortly, okay? He says he doesn't have a 14-day free trial link. I'm going to show you guys how we get that, how that, how we unlock that link. All right, so let's talk about the scholarship. A lot of you guys are amazing, amazing people. You're sharing uh, this challenge with everybody else, and this group is growing because of it. You're bringing people in here. I'm sending them back to you, sign up to ClickFunnels. Um I appreciate you guys. I want to reward you for it. Continue to share it, guys. There's a link in this description above. It's an up viral link. Go and share that in your social media. Give it to friends and family who could benefit from this workshop. Have them go and watch the replay from yesterday, the replay from today, and let them catch up for tomorrow. Keep sharing this. I'm going to pick one winner on Friday. You're going to get access to my Sales Funnel Mastery 2.0 program. You're going to get access to my Dream Car Accelerator, my highest program right now. Someone asked me earlier, Doug, do you have a coaching that you do? Yes, I do. Here's I'm giving away for free to one person on Friday uh, who, who does these things by share, registering, number one, first step, register at 5dayfreedom.com if you have not done that yet. Yes, I fixed the spell into mandatory. Thank you guys for shouting that out. Hashtag imperfect action. <laughs> uh, number two, you're going to go, oh my goodness. Number two, complete the homework every day before midnight. It's mandatory. I need you to finish the homework every night. All right. We had almost 700 people. Almost all of you guys did the homework yesterday. Today's task is going to be a little bit harder. I want you guys to prove me wrong. I bet you guys, we won't do at least uh, the same amount as yesterday. Prove me wrong. I want to see you guys all do the homework today. I really want to be proven wrong. All right. Number three, share this with friends. Uh, click the button. Um, uh, on the thank you page after you register here or go to the up viral link, share that. Um, you get extra entries into uh, the drawing on Friday for people when you share this with people. Um, you also could unlock a few courses I have, like my affiliate launch mastery. And uh, you can even unlock a one-on-one -on -one call with me if you hit 100 points. Really cool stuff. 
All right, and then the top contributors in this Facebook group are getting extra entries. Uh, right now, I just posted earlier the top 10 contributors. Thank you guys so much. Uh, right now, um, number one is gonna get three extra entries. Number two is gonna get two extra entries. And then uh, number three through 10 are getting one extra entry into the drawing on Friday. Pretty cool. And um, how do you be a top contributor? Well, you collaborate in this group, you connect, you comment, you like, you post, you share. Uh, don't abuse that too. I don't want you just posting the post. That's gonna drive me crazy. I don't want you guys posting a million things in this group. I'd rather see you co uh, connecting in comments, um, collaborating, encouraging others to finish the homework and, and everything like that. Answering questions you see. It's hard for me to answer everyone's questions. If you guys can help me answer questions, that's powerful, I appreciate you. That's how you're a top contributor. Cool, that's enough about the scholarship. We're gonna talk more about that on Friday. Can't wait to work with one of you guys all year long to help you smash your goals and walk stage at Funnel Hacking Live 2021. All right, winner will be announced this Friday, the 22nd. Now here's your homework. Let's, uh, let's take this slow. I really wanna explain how we do this today, all right? Who do you serve and what problem do you solve? These are the questions you're gonna to get to answer tonight when you do the assignment. You're gonna name your course. Your name is gonna basically be calling out your avatar and telling them the problem you solve. Um, you're gonna outline your lessons, right? Those three to four to five videos. It could be three videos, it could be four videos, it could be five videos, it's up to you. I wouldn't do more than that though. All right, come up with those lessons and exactly what you're doing in each one. Um, tomorrow we'll go more into scripts. Right now I just want you to focus on names. I'm actually gonna teach you guys what to say in these videos tomorrow. I'm gonna to build out this whole area, course area, so you could upload your videos and put them in there uh, by the end of the week. All right, so um, how will you monetize it? I want you guys to grab your resources and your affiliate links. If you're not promoting ClickFunnels, go find out who you could partner with. Who can you refer people to? What tools and resources can you give to them that you're making money on? All right, how can you monetize it? So these are the four things I want you guys to do tonight. However, all I want you to do for your task is this one thing. I want you to go to the group, unit number two, and I want you to answer, what is the name of your free course? I'm going to show you guys where to post on this right now. So make sure you guys follow instructions. Uh, again, you guys could go through this workbook at your own pace. If you already know the name of your course, you, then don't do these things. I don't want to waste your time. You don't have to do all these. These exercises to the right are to help you choose the name of your course. If you already know who you serve, what problem you solve, and you know what you're teaching, and you know the name of the course, then don't worry about this stuff. Just go and put the name of your course on the homework post. Cool. What questions do you guys have for me? Uh, I'll start with uh, Guillermo about uh, the 14 free trial link. But again, let me show you guys where to post the homework right now. Let's do this together so you guys see. We're gonna go into the Facebook group. We're gonna go, um, hopefully it's posted. Yep, uh, we're almost over an hour. Oh my goodness, we're over an hour. All right, um, so what I'm gonna do is find day two. Let me just make sure this is under unit two. I think it's already there. So units, we come down to the second unit. Let that load. So all we want in this in this in this week is unit number one. Watch the lesson replay, and then unit number two. This is where you post the homework, guys. Right here. See this? It says day two homework, Tuesday, May nineteenth. Click here. <laughs> Click here, and we already got one comment. I don't want you guys commenting um, up here. Uh, this is wrong. 25 of you guys are wrong. Don't post up here. Find the actual day homework. Click on it. Boom. You're going to go right here. Sales Funnel Mastery. Five ways to monetize. Monetize. Click Funnels. That's my course name. Boom. Homework's done. We got Guillermo. Shampoo Empire Domination. Love it. I don't quite get it though. Maybe just uh, reframe a little bit. I love the imperfect action. Just post it. If you guys don't make this perfect, post your homework. Um, again, like let's just take a look. Um, we had we had 635 of you guys complete the homework yesterday. I want 635 comments on this homework post tonight by midnight. You got this. I promise you could do this. Take imperfect action. This isn't your forever idea. This is just for you to go out and understand what you need to do. All right, so that's your homework assignment. What is the name of your free course? Post it here. Tomorrow, we're gonna build it out. Tonight, map it out. Tomorrow, we're building it. I'm gonna give you guys scripts to your videos. We're gonna hone in. We're gonna put together your course area. I'm gonna show you how to make it look pretty. I'm gonna show you guys all the things. Cool? All right, guys, I'm over time. Let's make this quick Q&A. Let's do it. Let's do this.
So again, Guillermo asked about not having a 14 day free trial link. That is completely normal. What's going on with that is ClickFunnels is making it a little more difficult to be an affiliate. Why? Because they're protecting their company from the FTC. They're, they're protecting us. They're protecting us from getting shut down because there's a lot of spammers out there in the world and they don't know this information I'm giving to you. They don't know how to do this the right way. So let's do this the right way. Um, and now what they're doing is you can't get your 14 day free trial until you've made a thousand dollars with click funnels by promoting their other products, including the books and one funnel away challenge. Here's the shortcut. The shortcut is to focus on promoting the one funnel away challenge. Um, if you're promoting click funnels, come up with those five videos, four to five videos on that last video, you're gonna be promoting click funnels, one funnel away challenge. All right, and that's the goal. You're gonna get people traffic to this group. You're gonna get 10 people buying one funnel away challenge super fast as soon as this, this week is done and you've got this all set up for yourself, all right? So focus there. After you make your first thousand dollars in 30 days with ClickFunnels, they know you're serious. They're gonna reward you by paying you more percent commission and you're gonna get all your links, including the 14 day free trial link. Does that make sense? Cool, so don't get upset at them. Don't be like, oh, ClickFunnels are being mean. You're not gonna be my 14 day free trial. No, they're protecting you, they're protecting us. Uh, we don't want it. We don't want that program to go away. You know, it's like half my income. <laughs> so um, it's okay. We're going to sell 10 one fall away challenges. We're going to be okay. Cool. And then you're going to get your 14 day free trial link. What else do we got guys? Uh, any questions for me? We got a little bit of time. I'm going to end this. I don't want to, I don't want people to see an hour and a half video and freak out. Okay. Bu -bu -bu -bu. This is really what I need. Thank you so much. You got it. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Shweta, hey, dog, if I messed up yesterday's homework, post in the wrong. Yeah, don't worry about it. You're not out of the scholarship race. Just make sure you fix it. All right. I, I'm forgiving. I'm a forgiving person. Make sure you guys just follow the instructions. Cool. No worries. I, I'm not trying to call anybody out. I just want to make sure you guys are doing the right things. Michael, focus on OFA. Yep, that's the key. We got Val, just to clarify really quick, homework is just name of your course. Yes, just name your course right on unit number two, um, day two homework, click on that image, post your homework, which is name your course. That's all I need you guys to do to be qualified for the drawing on Friday, all right? Rafa, is it better to promote OFA or 14 day free trial? Personally, it's better to promote one final way challenge. Here's why, um, because it's gonna, educate them, it's gonna bridge that gap for them, understanding what a funnel is and let them learn the right way. Um, unless if you wanna do it yourself, like when I first started, I was actually guiding people through the challenge, but I was doing accountability in my feet. My group started off as a one funnel away challenge accountability group. I went live every day for 30 days for 15 minutes explaining what the task was that they gave us each day and bridge that gap, help them finish the challenge because the challenge is hard. 30 days, it's a lot of information in 30 days. So I encourage people to do that. Oh, I lost the comments. Hold on, what's going on here? Oh, I lost the comments. Hang tight, guys. Sorry. What other questions do we have? You guys are amazing, by the way. This is awesome. All of you guys hung out with me all day. I know this is a long training, but it's going to help you guys, I promise. Uh, Karen says, confused. You said title and five videos for homework, and now you're only saying the course only. No, listen. I know this is confusing. I want you guys to do all those things on your own pace, but to be qualified for the homework and the drawing on Friday, just post the title. By you having a title, it shows me you did all those other things. All right, so all I need you to do to be qualified on the homework post, I just don't want you guys putting all this information on the, the homework post. I just want the title of your course. I still want you to go do that task on your own time, of course. You know, go through the workbook, go through this exercise at your own pace, but all I need to know to know you did the homework is what is your course title? Um, of course, I want you to go name your lessons and figure out what you're going to be doing. Like, think ahead of it. You know, let's, let's let's keep pace. But just post the homework on day two homework. I'm sorry if that's confusing still. I know I talk fast, but yes, that's do that stuff at your own pace. But by tonight at midnight, I need you to know the name of your, your um, course, even if it's going to be something different tomorrow. Just go do the homework. Post it on that post, you know, unit number two. Natalia says, thank you, Doug. That was awesome. Thank you. Thank you, Natalia, for being here. Mike Parker, do you recommend doing one funnel away challenge at the same time as this course to give real life examples? If you could pull it off, sure. Um, honestly, I don't know. I don't wanna be biased and say don't do the one funnel away challenge if you're focused here. I want you guys to focus here. Of course I'm gonna be biased. Focus here because I'm teaching a lot of what they teach in that course, but I'm simplifying it. When you really get a simpler result faster, um, one funnel away challenge is amazing, but I'm giving you guys kind of a similar outcome without building a complicated funnel. I'm calling it the freedom funnel. So it's a membership area. It's a one free course that's going to track, nurture, and convert your leads on autopilot. 
and we could do it in five days instead of 30. So cool. Marcelo, the OFA here in Italy is very hard to sell because very few people talk English. Here's my tip to you. Teach it in your own language. The obstacle is the way. Go teach it to your people in your language. That's what I want you to do. Go through the challenge. Take that task. Translate it and say, hey, here's what you talk about today. Go do this task. Bring them through it. Say, hey, if you sign up to the One Funnel Away Challenge, I'm going to teach it to you tonight in Italian and show you the task and how I'm doing that task myself. Instead of watching two hours of things in English, I'm going to teach you in 15 to 30 minutes today. Go and recap it every day. Translate it. You'll be amazed how far that could go for you. The obstacles away. Preach. All right. Uh, for clarity, I love the question. Uh, Luz says, is OFA different than 14-day trial? Yes. The 14-day free trial is the, the software. The OFA challenge shows you how to use the software. Does that make sense? Yep. So they're different. Cool, guys. I don't see any more questions coming from. Uh, someone says something about the workbook. The workbook is in the link. It's 5dayfreedom.com forward slash workbook. Grab your workbook there. All right. All right, guys. One, one, one. Still have you guys watching here. One, one, one. I love that. All right, guys. You guys know what to do. If you guys have any questions, post it in the group. Post your homework on unit two. Day two homework. Post it there. I want 635 comments tonight, okay, by midnight. Midnight Pacific time. Uh, Donna, I already have a ClickFunnels account. I signed up for affiliate link. Where do I find it? Go to the top right corner in your dashboard. Click that button in the top right corner. It's going to say affiliate. Click on affiliate and go find your uh, your affiliate links there. All right. Hope that helps. I could do a demo in the group if you need me to. If we are starting to promote ClickFunnels, wouldn't our free course be about using ClickFunnels like your free course? How do we differentiate ourselves from you and not compete? You find somebody that you can help. It's all about the who you serve and what problem you solve. Niche down. Um, I showed you guys a ton of examples. We have Jade working with LGBTQ. We have Ryan working with overworked parents. We have uh, Frank working with fathers. We have people working with um, like real estate agents. We have people working with uh, chiropractors. We have people working with CPAs, right? Tyler S. Clark went and hit dream car status by just helping 100 accountants Build a funnel. He gave them the funnel and said, hey, here's how you set it up. Your free course could show them how to set up an accountant for um, a funnel for accountants. So to answer your question, niche down. Find someone that you can serve, all right? Um, or you can compete. If you want to compete, feel free, but uh, I would. you'll go so much further collaborating by finding a specific type of person you can help. All right, go through the exercises to find out who that person is. All right, guys, that's all I got for you. We're going way over time. I appreciate you guys so much. 635 comments tonight and homework day two. I want that to happen. Prove me wrong. I want I want to see you guys win. Um, I'll see you guys tomorrow, 11 a.m. Pacific time, and that's 2 p.m. Eastern time right here in this group. We're going over day three. We're going to build out your courses tomorrow. It's going to be exciting. All right, I'll see you guys then. Take care. Enjoy your night. Oh, man, that was fire. Ron, I, gosh, I hope everyone is enjoying it as much as I am. You know, I, I think it's perfect timing for us because, you know, we have this course that we're trying to launch, but we are just missing one little piece. That's right. And so our Now 22 program is coming out very, very, very soon. But we need to give the people, we need to give our people just something a little bit before that. And so we have Hacking Your Why. It's an, an ebook with it we wrote because uh, we got you got to understand why you're doing things. We have hacking your perfect day that goes hand in hand with with the why but what, what is it we're missing you know we're missing who they're serving and i mean we know how hard that was to kind of niche that down and i think it'd be phenomenal if we were able to help other people niche it down quicker to speed up their learning curve that took us a pretty long time to figure it out yeah, so hack your why, figure out your perfect day, and then figure out who it is you want to go work with, right? Figure out that right. who. Right. And then part right right after that, you're going to be able to jump into the Now 22. Yep, absolutely. It's the perfect step right into it to get you launching amazingly well. Okay, so uh, definitely for everyone listening, if you like what you're hearing, go ahead and hit subscribe button and uh, like, review us. 
Tell us what you think. You can always also find us in facebook.com forward slash groups forward slash hindsight hacking, or just search us on YouTube and we'll be right there for you uh, for every step of the way. Absolutely, guys. And we just want to personally thank you for being the best part of the Hindsight Hackers community.